hello everyone welcome back to my channel uh, today we are going through cambridge primary checkpoint mathematics paper 1 uh, this is latest paper from october 2022 series time to complete this paper is 45 minutes uh, as this is first paper so we cannot use calculator in this you are not allowed to use calculator these are the instructions here you can go through before we start i request you guys to subscribe to my channel if you have not done so those who have already subscribed thank you so much guys for your support so let's start question one uh, tick the angle that is closest to size to the right angle so if you observe these angles this is acute angle less than 90 this is nearly 90 90 angle 90 usually looks like this right uh, so this is the nearest one and this is bit higher than 90 and this is closer than 90 uh, and this is obtuse so this is going to be the correct answer which is nearest to the 90 angle 90 uh, now here is a rectangle the rectangle is drawn accurately write the perimeter of rectangle as you are given here like see the rectangle is drawn accurately usually it's they write here not to scale not to scale means then you cannot measure that now it says like rectangle is drawn accurately so we can just uh, measure the side here <coughs> this side we do have here you can just use this one five centimeters so this is five centimeter and this side we have three centimeters so now the perimeter is sum of all the sides perimeter is sum of the sides all the sides uh, so that means five centimeter plus three centimeter plus five centimeter plus 3 centimeter because this is a rectangle so opposite side this side is equal to this and these two sides are equal so if this is 5 this is also 5 this is 3 this is also 3 now add them together 5 plus 3 8 8 plus 5 or you can just do 5 plus 5 10 and then this is 6 10 plus 6 it is 16 centimeters so final answer is 16 centimeters right now the next one here uh, we have number three a radio cost dollar 85 music player cost dollar 26 less than radio so write the cost of two music players now cost of radio we are given cost of radio radio is cost radio's cost is dollar 85 and music player music player the cost is dollar 26 less than the radio so radio's cost is 85 so 26 less than that so if you uh, subtract this one so 85 minus 26 that will give you the cost of radio uh, sorry uh, music player so 15 minus this is 7 15 minus 6 is 9 15 minus 6 is 9 here is uh, uh, 7 because one goes here for, as a carry so 59 so dollar 59 <coughs> is the cost of music player so we are looking for the total cost of the two so cost of music player here dollar <coughs> 59 so now you add them together 144 dollars so 144 dollar is the cost of both radio and the music player right now number four mia says i'm thinking of a number i subtract 18 from the number the answer is 35 so let's say mia's number is x uh, she subtracted 8 from the number 18 from the number and the answer is 35 right so now to remove we need the value of x here so x is going to be uh, 35 move this 18 to other side uh, plus 18 so this is 43 
no 53 sorry this is 53 because uh, when you add Eight plus five thirteen, then one carry, then this is fifty three. So final answer is fifty three. Number five, Perry has arranged twelve counters as an array. Right? Complete the two multiplication sentences shown by the array. Uh, so you see, we have four, and this side we have three. So it is four times three. And or maybe three times four. You can write in any of the two ways, right? Now here, uh, number six. Here is a parcel on a spring scale. Uh, this is a spring scale, which is in kilograms here. Uh, so write the mass of the parcel. So you see here we have zero, one, two, and three. The less than three between two and three. So if you observe, there are like. One, two, three, four, five, five sections there, right? Uh, so if this is 2.2, 2.4, 2.6, 2 but then this is 2.8. So that means this middle one is 2.50, right? And then this is going to be 2.25, and this is going to be 2.75. So that is 2.75 kilograms. Number seven, Mike has 56 cakes. Uh, one box holds nine cakes. Write the number of boxes Mike needs for all the cakes, right? So we will divide. There are 56 cakes to put in the box. So one holds nine. So let's see. Uh, nine times six, 54. If he put six cakes, uh, I mean uh, six boxes, then two of the cakes will uh, remain there, right? So still he has to put that in there. So he needs to have six boxes plus one more. So uh, to put the remaining of this um, two cakes, right? So the final answer is going to be seven boxes. So he needs in total seven boxes to put all 56 cakes. Now, number eight, Olivier and Yuri are playing a game. They both have set of digit cards from zero to nine. Uh, the cards are not in order. They each turn over the first four cards and add them together. The winner has the largest total. Uh, Olivier turns these cards and Yuri turns these cards. Write the lowest card that Yuri needs to win the game. You see, there are so many um, uh, facts given here I mean uh, the information in different sentences so you should always underline the keywords uh, that can help you for the answer so the cards are from 0 to 9 right they the cards are not in order they each turn over the four cards and add them together so now let's see Olivier Oliver's he got cards 4 3 5 and 6 then say they add them together so let's add them 4 plus 3 7 plus 5 12 plus 6 18 so olivier got total of 18 right and yuri turns over yuri is having 2 plus 4 plus 8 and one card is missing here uh, so the total of this is uh, 4 plus 2 6 it is 14 plus something so now what that is our question write the lowest card that yuri needs to uh, yuri needs to win the game so the total for oliver is 18 so this should be more than 18 because the winner has the largest total so for making this more than 18 that means it can be 19 right so what number should come over here 14 plus 5 so he can have the smallest number which is, that is 5 that can make total more than Olivier's total right just go through this question again because uh, there you have to combine this information to reach to the conclusion question 9 here is a coordinate grid uh, there are the vertices of rectangle marked on the grid this is the rectangle you know the rectangle is a shape like this having these angles 
right angle and opposite sides equal write the coordinates of the fourth vertex so you see then 1 2 3 so fourth vertex should come over here so what are the coordinates first we are going to write down x x is 5 and you see x is 5 here and y is 1 so our answer is 5 and 1 uh, make sure you write first the x coordinate then you write y coordinate this is for x and this is for y question number 10 here are two mathematical symbols greater than and less than write the symbol in each box uh, correct symbol in each box so uh, this is you know like alligator so its mouth is going to open uh, towards the bigger number so this is 4.73 4.65 the whole number is same so we'll just compare with the decimal part so 73 is greater than 65 so this is going to be this side uh, this is 21 this is 09 because the whole part is same so that again is going to towards this side this is 7 and this is 10 so this one is greater so it's like this so that's it for this video remaining question we are going to do in the next video so i hope you guys understood uh, let me know in the comment section about the video and thank you so much for watching please subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends i'll wait for your comments guys See you in the next video. God bless you.